It's a cold Thursday afternoon aboard USS Guardian. The ship is buzzing with anticipation as sailors wait for the call to start their anti-terrorism training. This is Force Protection Officer. Start the problem, start the clock. Today we went through drills that included entry checkpoint where we had an active shooter. We put him down on the mess decks where he was to actively engage the ship's reaction force. After that, we put an improvised explosive device hit on the ship. I got a bomb on the ship. The ship then had to locate where this bomb was at. What kind of bomb is it? It's a the red Guardian one. plans to make port visits there, during their deployment, that but that doesn't mean it's all fun and games. The, the ship there. and its crew it's must be ready to react to, to any possible, possible security out. threats. In Japan, we're used to being in force protection condition alpha. Some of the places we go will be at force protection condition bravo. It's important for the crew to be ready to respond in those ports that have an increased force protection condition. Although the events were timed, the goal wasn't to finish in a hurry, but to improve response time and make the right decisions. If you're not prepared, people don't know what to do. But with these drills and constant training, they know automatically what to do in every different type of situation. This exercise was just one of several drills the crew ran prior to deploying. The commanding officer is pleased with his crew's efforts. I'm proud of them. I'm proud of all the work they've done getting ready for the deployment. And I'm proud to be their commanding officer and I couldn't be happier than to be going on this deployment with this group of guys. Well trained and confident in their skills. Outstanding job, Guardian. The Guardian sets sail. Booyah, Guardian! Petty Officer Hillary Browning, Fleet Activity Sasebo, Japan.